welcome back. Where else can you grab a freshly baked donut all right, and uh, check out a baby lemur? All in the same place. Aww. Can you do that? Is that, is that possible? I know, I oh, wait, know. Not just any baby lemur, but a baby lemur clinging to a mama linger. Linger? <laughs> mama, mama lemur. They, they haven't had any animals kind of combined wallabies? yet. Wallabies? Are they there too? You can go stroll with the wallabies too. And I know the answer. Anderson and Girls Orchards is where the wild things are, Todd. <laughs> you can get up close and personal at their free petting zoo. And we recently stopped by to see what's new this year and to check out some of our all-time favorites too. <laughs> A sweet spot in Montcalm County where all the wild things are too. I'm talking about Anderson and Girls Orchards, family favorite place for my family for many years. And Amy, people come from all over to enjoy your wonderful shop and the free petting zoo too. Yes, um, we love what we do here. Uh, open every day, nine to six. Uh, you can come out and you can get fresh baked goods in the morning and a cup of coffee and enjoy your donuts on the on the picnic table, especially when it's a beautiful day. Um, you can have ice cream. You can have lunch here. We have all kinds of goodies for you. You can spend the whole day here. I love seeing families from morning until close. It's, it's, a, it's a great feeling to know that the family is having a great time together at our farm. So. And, and honestly, it's on the list of things that kids always ask to do on a nice day, especially when school's getting out and the weekends are starting to get a little bit more relaxed. So what is it about some of the things you have here that you think people come back for over and over? Our donuts. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. We have I the agree. best donuts. We also have uh, one of the best chocolate shakes around. So if you haven't had our chocolate shake, check that out. Our petting zoo area is free and you can come out and we just ask you leave a little bit in the donation box, whatever you feel comfortable with and have a great time with your family. And this truly is a family affair. The, the mom, mom works cash register, you're out man in the farm or woman in the farm I should say and your husband is also very involved with this and your dad. So I love the fact that it's Anderson and Girls Orchards being a farm girl myself. That's something that really hits home for a lot of people. Yeah, yeah. So I'm the oldest of the girls and um, once in a while in the fall you'll get to see all three of us out here together and my mom and dad working side by side. Um, we, we love what we do here and we love to see your family having a good time at our place. Yeah, definitely is a favorite spot and we're standing in front of this awesome store and inside the store let me tell you what it is jam packed full of jam jelly baked goods and a boutique yes so upstairs we have a few uh, clothing line uh, you can get your spring outfit we also have lots of hoodies and sweatshirts the hoodies uh, have our name on them we got some new crew necks coming in and I also did this section this year that has uh, all your bonfire needs so we have fat wood we have colored pine cones you can throw in your fire and have colored flames uh, if you guys ever need like a baby gift it's baby shower season wedding season all sorts of great gifts that maybe are a little bit more unique that you wouldn't normally get somebody yes yes we try to have unique stuff that's not offered at your local store or the mall so that it's special because it came from a local a local business so one thing that's really fun for a lot of people that come here of course yeah they want to go in the shop but they want to go out to the animals we're going to go ahead and catch up with katie out in the wallaby area Up close and personal to where all the wild things are is definitely an understatement here at Anderson and Girls Orchards. We're in the Wallaby Walkabout. Obviously, it's more of a lounge about today while we're here, but that's okay. Katie, this is just one species of creature that you guys have here. Yeah, we have several. We have over 200 mammals here. Um, we also have several birds. Um, there's about 15 to 20 different species of birds here. Um, I can't even list how many different species of mammals we have, but um, our wallabies we have out here. We have also some um, baby goats out here for people to feed and visit on the weekends. We also have our parakeet building behind us, which is what some of the noise is back there. Um, so you can go in and feed the parakeets for a dollar. Uh, you can also just come out here and chill with the wallabies. It's free to walk out here with the wallabies and see them. They just hop around or, or lay here like this. <laughs> They're so cute, so photogenic, aren't they? Yep. And some of them do have joeys in their pouches, so if you're lucky enough to see a joey, it's a pretty cute thing to see. Oh, very cute. Okay, we had some very loud neighbors also that you might see. They're inside right now because they were very loud neighbors. What happens in this cage behind us? Who lives there? <laughs> so we have our pair of black and white rough lemurs. Their names are Bubba and Chloe. Um, they they do love to scream very loud and kind of startle people. It's kind of their main gig now. <laughs> um, they're one of the largest of the lemur species. They're also one of the more aggressive lemur species. So they, of course, are behind our barrier where people can't touch them, where some of our animals are. So of course, when you're here visiting, if something's not behind a barrier, you can usually touch it and it's safe 
to touch, but uh, Bubba and Chloe definitely like to give people a run for their money. Now you guys are always trying to add something new, do some updates, so what types of things can people expect when they come here this year? Um, so this year when you come, we have a new Lynx enclosure, so they have a much larger space this year because they are officially a year old now. We also have a new camel stand this year, so once we're able to do camel rides through the summer and fall, you'll be able to see that and go up on there and get a better view of the camels because our camels are quite large. Our goat area is quite popular with kids. Um, you can come and feed them. We have quarter machines for food. On the weekends, we also sell cups of food for $5 and you can get different um, vegetables and, and fruit to feed the goats. They just come right to you. You don't have to do any of the work. They do the work for you. Um, we also have some alpacas you can see. We've got them in two different spots now, so it's not as crowded if people want to visit the alpacas a little bit longer. So we have our ringtail lemurs that had their first baby ever this year. Um, we've had lemurs for about 12 years now, and this is the first time we've ever had ringtail lemurs born here, so we're pretty excited about that. Um, we'll have baby goats come August. So we'll have babies all season long, basically. Yeah, so bring your babies, big, little, and the big kids love it here too, to Anderson Girls Orchards. Once again, they're located on 66, just north of Stanton, about an hour drive north of, of Grand Rapids. It's not bad at all. You know, not far from Mount Pleasant. Great location, the center of everything. Keep in mind, you know, this is a free petting zoo, but as I always like to say, because my family likes to go ahead and put donations yes. in that donation yeah. box, we donations do actually donations. help all of this happen. So yeah. yep. thank you so much. We gotta go out and pet some of these critters. Yeah. For sure, let's go do it. You know, my wife's done that. She's actually reached into a kangaroo's pouch and and touched a joey oh, yeah. inside there. Yeah, I never yeah. have. Did you get a chance to? No, I did not. We were always so busy when we we're there too. But I want everybody to know that when you come here, the great thing is like we found out with our son, like they love the animals, but they actually have a a play area yeah. that is just as popular. They have the slide, a tube that goes like through a hillside. Yes. And, yes, yes, uh, and, yes. and the kids are going to get filthy. Just let them get filthy, <laughs> dirty, have so much fun. And they have like a big tall ship they can climb on. Here's the address to get, go get filthy, go get dirty. Yeah, and have you got to go check it out, you guys. Honestly, go say hi. 2985 North Sheridan Road in Stanton. It's right on C M66 is, is also the name of that road. Go check them out online at andersongirls.com. You can also give them a call, 989-831-4220. 28. They do have a pavilion there too, so maybe mm -hmm. if you guys are in the planning stages for something that you want to do as far as a little get together, yeah. they have a nice little pavilion there for everybody too. Sounds like a good time. It is. Coming